Hi everyone. Hi everyone. My name is Lawrence J. Arbato. Hi, I am Cyrus J. And I am Junior D. Martin. In this video, we will be talking about National Blood Services Act of 1994. And now, let's start with our topic. What is National Blood Services Act of 1994? Republic Act No. 7719, also known as the National Blood Services Act of 1994. It promotes voluntary blood donations to provide sufficient supply of safe blood and to regulate blood banks. This act aims to inculcate public awareness that blood donation is a humanitarian act. There are five different ways to raise awareness about RA No. 7719. Like education. The Department of Health is heavily authorized to set aside funds and generate financial support for all sectors involved in the collection and processing of blood from voluntary blood donors to a system of reimbursement for costs for patients who can afford to pay or from donations from government and private institutions. Voluntary donors shall be likewise to be provided non monetary incentives as may be determined by the Department. Promotion and schools. The benefits and rationale of voluntary blood donation should be included and given emphasis in health subjects of schools, both public and private, at the elementary, high school, and college level. National education, the DOH, BCC, PSHBT, SP, PMA, PAMET, PNA are encouraged to conduct for their respective members and as part of the continuing medical education. Trainings on the rational use of blood and blood products, including the merits of voluntary blood donation. Establishment of Blood Services Network Blood centers shall be strategically established in every province and city nationwide within the framework of a national blood transfusion service network spearheaded by the DEH in coordination with the Philippine National Red Cross. The collection of blood in various areas in the community such as schools, business enterprises, barangays, and military camps shall be promoted. Walking blood donors in areas where there may be inadequate blood banking facilities. The walking blood donor concept shall be encouraged in all government hospitals, rural health units, health centers, and barangays. In these areas shall be required to keep at all times a list of qualified voluntary blood donors with their specified blood typing.